Hello all, uh, today we'll be doing a video on how you flash back the uh, stock ROM for the next bit Robin. So the current uh, most up to date stock ROM will be 7.1.1 .1. So what we are going to do now is to flash the 7.1.1 stock ROM back to the next bit Robin. Currently it's running Lineage OS. Okay, so before we start we'll need to make sure that we boot into fast boot mode. So what we how what should we do now is to press on the volume down key button and press on the power button. So that should bring you to this screen and this screen is the um, fast boot screen, right? So once we are done with that, then we will just need to plug our phone to the computer itself and, and basically move to the computer for the rest of the process. Okay, so bef before we start anything, make sure that you have ADB installed. So once you have ADB installed, and make sure you download the n108.zip, which is the um, latest uh, stock ROM version for the next bit Robin. So once you have that, do extract it out into a folder, and that's where we want to do our. You can do a zd108. So the r slash w. So that's where we want to do our fast boot stuff for for this, right? So okay, so once you have done with everything and make sure you're in fast boot mode what you can do is just to key in this command here which is fast boot minus i we have my lock go then you just press enter and it's done so from here you just need to do a flash all dot bad and it should actually flash everything back to stop 7.1.1 android and you press enter they will wipe the device then flashing then you do a yes then press enter and yeah they will be doing all the stuff flashing stuff and all recovery bootloader okay as you can see now everything is done so what you want to do is just to end press any key to exit the screen and you can reboot your phone for for the setup process to complete so as you can see now the uh, phone is rebooting let's plug out the cable and normally the first boot will will take a bit of time so we will just need to wait out for the first boot to finish so as you can see the um, the boot has finished so what you can do is just to click on next and they will you can skip the sim card you can set up as uh, fresh as new and uh, i think you can skip this but um don't use any network for setup continue um, then you can yeah you can actually don't set all this right just do a next wall just do a next wall, skip, skip anyway. You can skip all that, that's this stuff and stuff. Alright, so all set. Sync you have and media. Continue. Ah, you couldn't sign in, so you can do that later. So say hi to your new home screen. So this is what you have, right? You got it. So as you can see now, we are in the 7.1.1 version. The Pro One Security Patch. If you check on system updates, um, I don't think you would have the update. Frankly, let me key in the password first. So what we have here is, if you take a look at it, um, let's wait for the Wi-Fi to get connected. So once that is connected, we can actually see whether there is. I think this is the most the, the, the most recent updates. I don't think we have any more updates other than this. So like what I said, this is the latest update that we have for this thing. Uh, you might want to check the dates first. Let us fix the date to ensure that uh, 17 is correct. Uh, the time it's not. So we can set on the time zone that we want. GMT plus 8. Eight on my side, 
right so the time is this is correct so and we'll do the check again and um i basically download this from the latest website so this is the latest one so what you have is a pro security patch so if you still want the cloud functions for this phone then this is the most recent um, homeware stock that you can use and if you want the most latest security patch and all then the only thing that you can use is the uh, lineage os that gives you up to october uh, december patch uh, up as of today and it's running on 1.2 so that's the later one but it doesn't have the cloud aspect of it so my call is if you are still using this phone now might as well just make use of the cloud uh, capabilities uh, from this phone um, as long as you can so most probably once the cloud thing get deactivated then you can actually flash to lineage for um, for future use so okay that's all folks uh, that's all i have for today uh, if you like the video uh, please give it a thumbs up and uh, do subscribe for any future update of any other devices that i will be reviewing and be having tutorial tutorials about so um hope to see you again soon bye